Hello all my wonderful viewers. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to show you eight spots, glitches, whatever you want to call them, on Canal. I can think of one in specific that is a glitch, but all the others are more so spots, and I think I only showed two spots there inside, and there are eight. But um, I think two or three of them you could do as an attacker. But yeah, here, here they are. So this first one I didn't find myself. I'm not really sure who did find it, but I'm just gonna let them comment and tell me if they found it. And I'm gonna pin that comment, but uh, yeah, this is what you wanna do. So you wanna get on that shield and then have them stand like so. And you just wanna kind of crouch and just walk up against the little counter to get up here. If you want to walk across here, then you just have to make it so that your character falls a bit lower, because you can't really move around with that giant-ass vent right above you. But yeah, that's pretty much all there is to this spot. I was trying to find some more stuff to this spot, but there isn't really anything else you could do from up here. The second spot I actually found while I was trying to make the video. So you want to get on top of the shield. Well, actually, this is two spots in one, so you see how there's a vault symbol? Well, instead of standing up like I'm trying to do, you could just vault up normally. But what I actually end up doing is I stand up and I vault, and I, ended up, I end up glitching through the wall, as you will see. So this is uh, another spot It's in itself. I was actually trying to get up there earlier, but this is one you could do as an attacker, but you can get up there just by repelling, but... Repelling will take a couple more seconds than this will. So you just want to run up there. You can do that, but instead of using a shield, you can use a teammate. You can have them prone and then crouch after you get up, but... This spot... I might see myself using in Michael Myers, but probably not. I mean, I like getting up here also in ranked. It does help me. Sort of. Kind of. Not really. But, um... Yeah, this next spot... I, I can't even remember what the next spot is. Well, I guess we'll see when the clip comes. Well, I had to trim this clip, so... Yeah. Apparently it was a ten minute clip, but I had to trim it down to whatever it was. But you see how I'm vaulting how I am, you can actually get into there doing the method that I show. I actually do show my teammate getting in here in the next clip, but to do it without having to do that way, you just want to run on your teammates like so. And once you get on top of them, you just want to, you know, push yourself over there. And you're on the little speed boat. But, uh, yeah. Now I'm going to show you the clip where my teammate actually got it. So he did the vault thing so that he actually did what I was trying to do. He clipped past the barrier that was pushing you back. All you have to do is get to one of the specific poles to get onto the boat. And from there you can get out. You just have to stand on that pole and then you can vault up. And then, to get out, you're gonna see him vault on top of this pole. But, it, in, instead he decided to fall down with me. But, uh, yeah, that's how to do that one. Now this one, I think you can do with, uh, on attacking. Like, instead of placing a shield there, you need to have two teammates, uh, standing. But, that, that... That method's really hard to do, and at the time, I don't think I had two teammates in with me, because one had to go do something else. But, uh, yeah, this one's kind of, sort of, kind of cool for Michael Myers, because they usually don't know how to get up there. But this next one, I'm actually going to show you this clip first, because if you saw how I got up there, I look at this little stone, and I vault up here. So then you just have to run across to the other side, like you see me. So you run to the other side, and you get the idea. You'll see how to do it on the next clip. But yeah, this one I do with the shield. 
because I found it easier to get both me and my teammate up here. So you just want to like get on top of the shield and then you want to just run past their face and you can just run up here. So you can actually do this one as an attacker, but uh, yeah, it gets you a pretty nice view and seeing as how you can do it as an, as an attacker, that just adds on to it. It just makes this spot so much better. But, as you can see from what I am looking, you do get a really cool view at like everything out of a map. That whatever that is over there. The water is... But, um, I'm not really too sure what happened here, but something definitely happened. Now, this is the last spot of the video. This one, if you were to do it on attacking, would require three people. And to do it on attacking, you, instead of the shield there, you need a person. But you just run on top of your teammate's face. And once you do that, you can just crawl up here like a crisp giant. And uh, this could be of slight use if you actually used it in ranked. Like using a person instead of the shield. I don't know how useful this would be exactly, but you could see into the room, sort of, kind of, not really, but... Yeah, that's pretty much gonna be it for this whole video. You know, just drop a like, show us some support. And I'm making all these videos because I'm receiving support. And just thank you to everyone.